Hey guys, have you ever done a kettlebell swing and either while you're doing the swings, maybe after the workout or even the next day, you're feeling some uh, shoulder pain or fatigue uh, that maybe you shouldn't be feeling? That's probably because you're using too much arms in the kettlebell swing. Keep in mind that the kettlebell swing is a, um, is a hinging motion, all right? So we're using our hips, um, our, our butt, our hamstrings um, to get our power and that's what we're using uh, uh, to, to work this exercise okay so what you don't want to do is make it a shoulder exercise where it's all your shoulders are doing all the work now you are obviously using your shoulders in the in this in this exercise but think of it more as a byproduct and so you are gonna have a little bit of fatigue but it shouldn't be to the point where you're um, you're overexerting uh, just one um, or just your shoulder area like you would on say uh, bench press or uh, push-ups uh, handstand push-ups, uh, pull-ups, things like that, okay? So keep in mind, um, I'm gonna get set up. I'm standing over the top of the kettlebell. I'm going to get into a deadlift position. I'm gonna pick it up, and then from here, my hips go back, and then my hips go forward, and now I have the kettlebell going to about chest height, and you'll notice I have a little bit of an arm bend in my elbows. All right, and so what, what's that doing? It's taking the stress and the tension off of my, off the shoulder joint, off those shoulder muscles, and um, it's, it's keeping it to where my shoulder's gonna be a lot safer, all right? So what I wouldn't wanna do is this, where now I'm trying to fully extend my arms, all right? And I can already feel it more in my shoulders than I was when I had a bent elbow, all right? Same thing applies when you're doing a kettlebell swing overhead. You're still gonna have those elbows slightly bent, but then you're just gonna push that kettlebell to the top overhead. So what you wouldn't wanna do is something like this, where I'm just keeping my arms straight the whole time, slight bend in my elbows as I do it. All right, so the next time you're doing kettlebell swings and you feel like you're getting a little too much shoulder burn, uh, could be because you're keeping those arms straight just have a nice little soft bend it's also going to keep that shoulder safe help prevent you from having any injuries down the road